Good morning, Borada. Um, not very happy this morning. I didn't make this video last night because I'm holding my pledge not to swear. And if I'd have done it last night, there would have been a lot of swearing. So we're off with the John Deere and the Lamborghini to Anglesey. And you'll see why. Literally last night my dad gets a phone call from a lady that just lives in the house uh, over there called Brenda and she phones to say your cattle are in the yard. Now this gate was left open by somebody. It closes properly. It's not a job to close this gate. So I, you know I always say close the ducking gate. Well you should be closing every ducking gate you're going through. See what I did there? Okay. I'm cool, I'm calm. If you'd have heard my father swearing last night, I think it could be, yeah, one of the most sweariest persons I've ever heard. So, 60 or 70 of our cows came into our silage, yeah, and they beat and smashed these bales. Not just these bales. Look at that. Each one of these bales is worth at least 50 pound. There's a lot of work gone into baling these, growing the grass, fertilizer. And that's just, just part of it. There's another road down here. And this is why I'm frustrated, you know? This is why I do get really angry. I lose my temper, but I'm cool this morning, as you can see. More bales here. Every time somebody leaves a gate open or lets the dog off a lead, it costs the farmer people. It costs money, you know? There's two of us coming with two tractors to Anglesey today to sort out one person who hadn't left. They have the decency to close the gate. All these need to be fixed. And there's a couple down there. That's the frustrating thing. <clears throat> and, you know, I'm not an angry person. I'm not a nasty person. But people have to understand. We're producing food. You know, it's difficult enough. Farming's difficult enough. Margins are tight. Without, you know, this. And 
that's what I'm trying to get the message out there. Respect the countryside, close the gates, keep your dogs on the leads. Don't leave your litter. Make sure that you put your cigarettes out and you don't cause fires. There's, there's so many things that have massive effects on us. Um, yeah, that can be easily solved. If somebody just closed that gate properly, we wouldn't have to be doing all this. Keeps the fermenting going, and we don't want that. If you get air in the heat, it makes it rotten and not edible for the well, it's edible, but it's not, it's not good for the cows. It's better to seal and that's it. I'll pull it out. to patch quite a few over there and it's on that one's unpatchable so you can see it's gonna save a little bit of work I didn't see that one get that one done and then all these here need to be re-wrapped there we go first bill Honest to God, it doesn't rain, it pours. Fan belts come off the tractor now. Duck in hell, man. Ah. Well, it's not just a fan belt. I 
Unbelievable. <sighs> Fair play, Jason. The mechanic's on his way, so hopefully we can get back running very quickly. Here comes the support team. Oh, God. Let's get the show back on the road. Top mechanic. Here we go. Great service from Jason from Mona Tractors. Wales with him today. We're going to get the tractor going, boy. Yeah. Yes. Big job, Jace. Not too bad. Just nope. a couple of bolts and we'll be back up and running. There you go. Good service team from Mona. You can't go wrong. Living the dream, we hope. Been very, very grumpy this morning. Here we go. Back on the road. Yeah, that's it. Last bail done. Yeah, there's over there. Not happy. Lesson here for everyone is close the gate and respect the country. <laughs> 